hello guys so today we are going to make the rotating globe so this is the globe actually i have taken out this globe out of the assembly right so that i can fit the motor and all those type of things on this globe and this is the tire on which i will fit this globe and this is the motor okay this is the 10 rpm dc geared motor the rpm of this motor is very low 10 rpm and the uh, torque of this motor is very high and this is the base on this base i will uh, put all the arrangement right and now i'm going to grind this portion of this tire so that i can uh, fit this globe on this tire accurately this is the tire this tire i will use to fit on the motor and the globe will be fitted on this tire so i have used this drill so this drill through this drill i have made some hole in this tire like this hole this hole this one this one this one and this one right so that through these hole i will put nut and bolt and uh, can fit this tire on the globe so now i am going to fit the nut on this globe So one nut is fitted, now I am going to fit the another nut. Okay, so the two nut is fitted, although two nut is sufficient but I am going to fit third nut as well, so that there will be no problem. Three nut is sufficient, there is no need of fourth nut. Now I am going to uh, fit this motor on this arrangement. So now in the base we are going to fit the motor, uh, so this is the motor, 10 rpm motor and uh, we are going to fit the motor. So this is the glue gun, this glue gun have plastic in the molten form and now after some time you will see that this plastic will become hard and uh, the motor will be fixed. Put some more glue, put some more glue. So uh, now we have put down some wooden block so that it can fix the motor properly and then you we are using glue gun so that there will be a proper grip of the motor in this holder. So I have done three drill in this base so that I can put these three wooden block. Why? Because uh, the, the, these are the two connections of the motor where 12 volt will be applied so these two connections should not touch the ground so so we are going to increase the height of this space using these three blocks so we will use three a screw so these are the three screw we are going to use right these three screw okay so these are the three wooden blocks which we have fitted through these three nuts one two three now we are going to make the connection to this motor. Now this is the motor connection we have done. So this is 12 volt adapter. So this is the 12 volt adapter we are using. So this is driving this motor and this sound is of this motor, right? This motor is running now. The moment is very light, very small moment of this motor. Now we are going to fit the globe on this motor. So now our uh, rotating globe is ready. So you can see that this is the tire on which motor is fitted and motor is inside uh, this base. Right now we are going to own the power supply of the uh, globe on the power supply. Right. 
you can see that right our globe is rotating of this is the arrangement inside the base of the globe so this is all about this rotating globe if you have any doubt you can ask me question in the comment box and if i talk about the power supply of this adapter this is of 12 volt 1 ampere right thank you very much for watching this video